Hi, in this video I will show you app I have created for converting RSS uh, to JSON file. So this is my website, I will leave link to the description and to find the app I can type RSS to JSON, yep, this one. And I click on to open page, double click on the download button to start downloading process, click on download it archive and when archive will be open click double click on MSI to start installation and click on more info I'm getting this screen because I'm not registered publisher if it's a publisher unknown I'll just click run anyway to start installation click on next next install click on yes <coughs> and click on finish you can see app has been installed on my computer now I can close this and minimize this and double click to on shortcut to start app. Um, conversion is like three steps process. In first step, I, I can select file if I want to. If I have LRSS downloaded in my uh, in my on my local computer, I can do that. Or I can add URL from live RSS and pull data and download it in, uh, and um, download it and convert it into JSON. Now I have a slash dot RSS link here and I can pull it right from the website and load into JSON. I'll do copy link address, go back to my app, paste the URL here, click on add. Now, <coughs> after I selected which files uh, or URLs I want to convert, I'll go click on next step. Here I can select which way uh, result format I can present or flat is like just one structure. And then I can select columns from RSS I want to, to, to convert into my JSON. Because RSS has a lot of like technical columns and I am, for example, interested in the title and description. Which is like language, date, maybe date, yep, date is okay. And I can select all of them if I want to. And, uh, but it'll create a really big uh, JSON and uh, sometimes I don't need to select all. So I click on next step after I selected want to and here I can preview my JSON or I can save results to it and let's save it somewhere here I can specify folder and I can specify the name of the JSON file and as this name is okay I'll just click save <coughs> now I can open it open it in Firefox to see entire JSON structure and how it was converted Go and find my file. This is my file, right? I will just drag to um, Firefox. Yep, and you can see it's uh, uh, correct JSON with all data in it. Uh, so it contains each record contains title and description, and uh, yeah, and everything. All data is and date. Uh, because I selected date, so basically it's all like array of objects with with all data from slash dot inside. So you can convert it like from any side and um, select fields from this side you want and convert it into JSON. You use and then use it to uh, your web app. Basically that's it. If you have any questions, please leave them in comments. Thank you.